Alexander Petrovich Kozhdin Russian Alexander Petrovich Kazdin the 3rd of September 1922 to the 29th of May 1997 was a Soviet American Byzantinist Topic <inaudible> Biography Topic <inaudible> <inaudible> Soviet Born in Moscow, Kozhdin was educated at the Pedagogical Institute of Ufa and the University of Moscow, where he studied with the historian of medieval England, Evgeny Kosminsky. A post-war Soviet initiative to revive Russian-language Byzantine studies led Kozhdin to write a dissertation on the agrarian history of the late Byzantine Empire published in 1952 as Agrarnie Otnoshenia v Vizanti XIII 14 VV. Despite a growing reputation in his field, anti-Semitic prejudice in the Joseph Stalin-era Soviet Academy forced Kozhdin to accept a series of positions as a provincial teacher in Ivanovo, 1947–49, and Tula, 1949–52. Following the death of Stalin in 1953, however, Kozhdin's situation improved, and he was hired by a college in Veliki Luki. In 1956 he finally secured a position in the Institute for History of the Soviet Academy of Sciences, where he remained until leaving the Soviet Union in 1978. Kozhdin was an immensely prolific scholar throughout his Soviet career, publishing well over 500 books, articles, and reviews, and his publications contributed to the growing international prestige of Soviet Byzantine studies. His 1954 article, Byzantiyski Garoda VV11 VV, published in the journal Sovetskaya Archaeologia, argued on the basis of archaeological and numismatic evidence that the 7th century constituted a major rupture in the urban society of Byzantium. This thesis has since been widely accepted and has led to intensive research on discontinuity in Byzantine history and the subsequent rejection of the earlier conception of the medieval Byzantine Empire as a frozen relic of late antiquity. Other major studies dating from this first half of Kozhdin's career include Derevnia i Gorod v Vizanti XXVV, 1960, a study of the relationship between city and countryside in the 9th and 10th centuries, Vizantiskaya Kultura X12 VV, 1968, a study of Middle Byzantine culture, and Satsilni Sostav Gospodstivu Joschego Klasa Vizanti 1112 VV, 1974, an influential prosopographical and statistical study of the structure of the Byzantine ruling class in the 11th and 12th centuries. Kozhdin also contributed heavily to the field of Armenian studies, notably writing about the Armenians who formed the elite ruling classes that governed the Byzantine Empire during the Middle Byzantine era in his Armian v Sostave Gospods TV Yushogo Klasa Vizantiskoy Imperi v 1112 VV, 1975. United States In 1975, Kozhdin's son, the mathematician David Kozhdin, emigrated to the United States, where he accepted a position at Harvard University. This produced an immediate change in Kozhdin's situation in the Soviet Union. His wife, Musha, was fired from her position at a Moscow publishing house, and censorship of his work by his superiors in the Soviet academic establishment increased. In October 1978 Alexander and Musha left the Soviet Union, having received a visa for immigration to Israel, coming to the United States three years afterward. In February 1979 they arrived at Dumbarton Oaks, a center for Byzantine studies in Washington, D.C., where Kozhdin held the position of senior research associate until his death. Kozhdin's first major publications in English were Collaborative, People and Power in Byzantium, 1982, a broad ranging study of Byzantine society, was written with Giles Constable, Studies in Byzantine Literature, 1984, with Simon Franklin, and Change in Byzantine Culture in the 11th and 12th Centuries, 1985, with Anne. Wharton Epstein. His greatest English language project was likewise a massive collaborative effort, the three-volume Oxford Dictionary of Byzantium 1991, edited by Kozhdin, was the first reference work of the sort ever to be published, and remains an indispensable point of departure for all areas of Byzantine studies. He wrote approximately 20%, or about 1,000, of the entries in the dictionary, which are signed with his initials aka's Kozhdin became more comfortable with English, his pace of publication once again matched that of his Russian years. His later scholarship is above all marked with a growing concern with Byzantine literature, particularly hagiography. 
Kajdan died in Washington, D.C. in 1997. His death cut short his work on a monumental history of Byzantine literature, however, the first volume of this work, covering the period from 650 to 850, was published in 1999. Notes Further reading Cutler, Anthony Some Talk of Alexander. Dumbarton Oaks Papers, 46–1–4. ISSN 0070-7546. Franklin, Simon Bibliography of Works by Alexander Kajdan. Dumbarton Oaks Papers, 46–5–26. ISSN 0070-7546